Ladies and gentlemen, here's a real classic. And as I've been saying, you know, if you're watching this on YouTube later on, you obviously know what it is, but for the live audience, um, they don't have a clue. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is a actual classic. It is a uh, one of the best, as they say. Well, what is it? I would say when I think of like indie horror games on the PC, this has to be it. This is a uh, <laughs> super classic, and I'm probably not going to do any justice to this game's legacy, nor will I, you know, add th anything new to it. I'm just going to be playing it for the first time. I know about the memes and some of the, uh, the stuff surrounding this game, but I never actually sat down and played it myself. This is a, uh, <laughs> this is a super classic. Everybody knows this game. And, uh, well, frankly, I don't. This might be done in one sitting. I'm actually not sure how long this game is or anything like that. But, uh, you know, again, if you're watching on YouTube later on, you'll be like, oh, you know, okay. But again, the live audience has no idea what this is. But ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be playing it. And uh, when I'm talking about it, you'll be like, oh, shit. Okay. Before we begin, I want to say a little quick reminder uh, that tomorrow is the... Uh, big Halloween fuck you stream. Uh, the big fuck you stream is going to be uh, like a six, seven hour long, super duper scary thing. You know, it's going to be games, 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 games. It's going to be seven day spooky game stuff, plus additional stuff, plus Halloween stuff. And tonight, after the stream is done, we are going to be playing some Vineyard stuff. So ladies and gentlemen, get your, uh, get your uh, links ready. Don't post them in chat and make sure you have a token to get in. If you don't know what I'm talking about, get in contact with the mods and uh, we're going to do a big Halloween night tonight um, and tomorrow as well. So tons of streaming, you know, if you are, have nothing to do tonight and tomorrow, it's going to be watching a lot of movies. So there's that. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, I have never, ever played Yumi Nikki. Um, it's going to be my first time playing this. I meme about Uboa, but I have never sat down and actually played this game myself. I don't know if the Steam version I'm about to play is a little different from the other versions or whatever, but uh, this is not like a like a haha joke. And it always goes to show when, when people are like, he's joking, he's not gonna play this. It, it also goes to show like how, how massive a game is. When, when I dropped the can, oh, scared me, man. I'm not even into the game yet, and I'm already getting a you know? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, I nearly died on stream, you know. Anyway, uh, yes, uh, I, once again, it's the first time playing this, uh, so uh, I'm not even sure if we're going to be backseating or what we're going to do, but uh, yes, uh, Yumi Nikki, Yumi Nikki, uh, never played it. Let's give it a try, I suppose. Don't know how old this game is, it doesn't really say, but I believe this was like mid-2000s, and this game had a ginormous impact on, on... I guess the free horror, you know, PC genre, you know, it was 2004. So this game is almost 17 years old. That is a crazy long time, huh? But uh, I, I know a little bit about this game. It's it's a little bit like uh, LSD Dream Simulator or for the PlayStation. And I know about, well, particularly just one meme. I know about Uboa because uh, you might catch me doing like the, 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 the light flipping joke in some some sort of streams and uh you know it's ha 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 ubo i know about that but again i've never actually sat down and played this so i hope uh hope i'm in for something here uh, i don't know really anything about this game except you go around and you explore stuff well here we go how to play okay bedroom get in bed dream world pinch your cheek number key nine okay uh, dream world. By examining certain spots, you will you will acquire enter key a new effect to use. After using one of the th these effects from the menu, your appearance will change. You can get rid of the effects in the room of doors. A little more complicated than I thought, but uh... <laughs> all right. I'm sure it's not that complicated. But here we go. Okay, dream diary. You can save the game by waking up and checking the the desk in the bedroom. Okay. I guess this is it, huh? Was this made in RPG Maker? Was it? Yes, it was. Ah, okay, interesting. 
Is it Z and X to do stuff? <laughs> the says <say> fam tendo. <laughs> A game where you jump to grab the falling. Is that an eggplant? Okay, you know, I, I gotta do this, by the way. I have a... For years, I've had this green line across the screen. And it is super detrimental because it's ruining me reading stuff. There we go. There we go. <clears throat> Experience ruined. No, no, we're fine. Okay, game where you jump to grab the falling eggplant. Left, right. Uh, Alright. Watch me play this game more than the actual game. Because <laughs> they just gobble up the retro crap. The real game begin. Okay, ready. Alright. Well, this is Yuma Nikki. This is the classic. <laughs> okay, well. What am I? Am I a... Like a... Well, that was that. I, th <laughs> I thought about am I a pepper? Am I a pepper? Okay, I'm gonna do that again. Okay. So this version I'm playing is a Steam version. Is this like a re-release or is is this really it? Okay, I am bad at this. I am terrible. I bet Joel totally can't make it to a thousand points. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. Joel, how do you even read chat? God damn it! See, that's why. That's why. Fuck. What have you done? <laughs> Fuck's sake. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Oh, the hitbox is a. L Wait a minute. I gotta jump to get the the eggplant, right? Okay. 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 I, I got. I got this now. I got this now. Okay. Here we go. Okay, yeah. That's not our, not our problem, man. This is gonna be easy as fuck. Look at this! <sighs> I'm gonna be stuck here all day. Okay, dude, I, no, no, I can't, I can't do this. Okay. Hawker Friday, a thousand points in Yumaniku. Uh, tell you what, tell you what. Not this time, but at some point, maybe. Okay, and what's this? Uh, Madotsuki effect. Review games tutorial. We know about that. Okay. But apparently, this is the this is the right version of the game. This is not like some sort of weird re-release or anything like that. No, I don't want to go to bed yet. Okay. Do I go down here? Am I asleep or...? Okay... I'm guessing Yumaniki is not a very... Well, look at that. This is a very atmospheric game, and maybe it's not the best stream game, because this is more of like a journey you go through, and it's not very jump scary, so, you know. But again, I'm gonna just give it have my own take on it, I suppose, so, you know. But, uh... Okay. <laughs> Tomato Man. <laughs> Who's this guy, huh? <laughs> okay, we all feel in that one. Okay. Okay, I'm guessing there's no run in this. Uh... But that's fine. That's fine. Should Joel follow a guide? I I don't know. Okay, now now we're now we're puking up raspberry uh, jam. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, it's very very LSD dream simulated. This game. I I always kind of knew that, but uh, still, huh? Huh. I wonder if I'm supposed to get these. I'm so I'm so used to like puzzles and stuff in video games uh, that it's hard for me to just like take things in and just appreciate them at face well not really face value but just kind of as is which is this game is very 
visual. And I'm like, maybe there's a hidden switch in the tree, you know? <laughs> like, I'm conditioned to think that immediately. Well, I don't know, maybe, maybe it is. I, I don't know. Okay. I don't know if I should start talking about dreams in this stream, but maybe it's appropriate. But uh, did I tell you guys about the nightmare that I had about uh, that I couldn't control my body? At least good, good time to talk about nightmares and stuff like that. I couldn't control my body. It was a really weird dream. In the dream, I woke up in like real life, even though I was asleep. I didn't know. And I had this dream where, you know, it was the middle of the night. I got dressed and I started walking outside the house. And, like, I couldn't fight my own steps, so to say, you know. And I knew something was really wrong. Like, why am I walking so much? But I didn't question it too much. Until I got really deep outside the city, and I started walking into the forest. Creepy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this, this does something. Okay. Okay. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, what's this now? <laughs> Can I do anything? Maybe I should... Did you wake up? Yeah, of course. I was like, what, what was that? Maybe I can combine the ghosts. Okay, now I have several ghosts. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ghost friend. Oh, oh okay. It sounds like your neighbor playing the keep. Oh my, what is that? Uh, not a friend, I'm guessing. Or maybe? No, not at all. Uh, am I in. <laughs> am I in, like, some sort of jail? Uh, what was the thing about, like, if you get stuck, you can press something. Was it nine? Okay, you pulled your cheek, huh? Okay. Hmm. I don't know if I have infinite retries at this, but... Uh, Alright, and this is, this, this, is, this is still the day, so... Okay. Huh. Wasn't there mountains in the background before? Huh. Can I do anything else here? Huh? <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Yumaniki Lo-Fi Beats to uh, Sleep 2. Okay, this is to save the game apparently. Okay. Oh, okay, I gotcha. Cool. Oh, um, oh, I can't go outside if I'm not dreaming? Huh. huh. Can't do that, I guess. Uh, are these pillows? What are, what are those? These things, things are on the floor. Uh, okay, well. Here we go, I guess. Uh, three, two, one. Oh, in the dream world, there's like hills on the... In the background, huh? Okay. Huh. Well, I guess we're heading outside into Dream World again. Do you have to do this in sequence, or is it just explore as much as you want? Just explore, okay. I guess we'll try this one, then. This game is, like, very Moonside from Earthbound, though, I gotta say. <laughs> I like that dude in the background. Okay. 8-4... 84148089 Okay Note note down all the numbers. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if I can do that. Okay. Well, um uh, so far it's an interesting game. It's very uh very atmospheric and weird. And maybe it's the effect of this game is a little diminished because I'm streaming it, and it's meant to be very um, interpretive in a way. But I'm just taking it in, and just like what, what is it all? We'll see. 
<laughs> Somebody chat says, my IP. <laughs> my Wi-Fi password. Okay. Okay. We're heading in here, I suppose. All right, that's the binary, I guess. Okay, well... You know what I kind of like about this game? It was made in RPG Maker, but I'm guessing there's no actual RPG elements at all. I'm guessing the developer just needed a, like an engine to get something out. And, you know... There is... Oh, well... <coughs> oops. Okay, well, then again, look at that. We have health. So... I can't imagine how... <laughs> how weird it must be if this game has like... Like a Final Fantasy battle system. Okay. Maybe I'm supposed to. These maps are huge, man. Okay. Anything up here? I feel by just going into one door, it might lead to something I might not want to go. Okay. Is it looping? I'm guessing it's looping. I'm gonna try going left instead. Hmm. Right. Tiny. Oh, hey, 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 hey! You know, this game is great, but nobody ever told me that this game has a bopping soundtrack. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Hello. found myself. Okay. Anything else I can do? Huh? Looks a little bit like magic in here, huh? There was a reference to this in Vine Worlds. Oh, there was, and I told him. Okay. Ah. Okay. Hey, man, there's a Halloween trick-or-treat grab bag of quality spooky games waiting for you on your DMs. Oh, I'll give that a try. You know, again, there's Halloween tomorrow. And, uh, you know, I want to see, I want to see what else I can, like, maybe put in there, so, but, uh, you know. I, I don't know if this, this game is more a, if it's a scary game, or if it's because, I, you know, dreams, dreams are terrifying, you know. But, then again, horror is pretty subjective, you know. What scares one person might not scare the other, you know, vice versa, and, uh, hey, look at this. Okay. I think this is the kind of horror game that, well, not horror game per se, but you know what I mean. It sits with you, you know. It's like when I was playing, um, when I was playing the Lighthouse game, I really liked the visuals at the first part. But uh, by the way, uh, Frank actually informed me that um, there is a way to play the original game, not the director's cut. And uh, apparently, again, it's been reaffirmed by a lot of people, but the original version of uh, it li Nobody Lives Underneath the Lighthouse is much better than the director's cut. So, you know, you played the wrong version. You know. Okay. Is that a zipper? <laughs> what is that? Man. I've always had this weird dread of getting like, like the hoodie stuck in flesh. D d d no, not a hoodie. I mean, my hoodie, if I zip it up, some it sticks into your skin. <laughs> Dick in zipper. No, that's not what I meant. That's not what I meant. Jacket or whatever. Because that, that happened to me. That happened to me once. It's a horrifying feeling. Yeah. <laughs> I like, I like, I'm just like, yeah, things hurt, and immediately you guys go like, ha 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 ha, Yenitol's destroyed. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Alright, so we've gone to the very left, but I'm guessing this is here. 
I could easily get the, the dark background here and overlay some X-Split funny, but I'm gonna give the game the respect it deserves, you know. <laughs> Having Raccoon eating grapes for the, you know, 500th time on screen is like... <laughs> do it. But you know what? It, it's, a, it's an interpretive dream game, so... Who knows? It could be fitting. Okay. One of the absolute creepiest things I've ever heard in my life. This is actually a true story. One of the creepiest things I've ever heard in my entire life is when I was nine or ten. I don't know why I'm sharing this per se, but uh, I'll tell you anyway because it's a dream game or whatever. Um, I woke up one day. Mom and Dad was sitting at the, the breakfast table. And Dad says something about, oh, I had such a terrible like nightmare. And Mom said, yeah, me too. Oh, you had a nightmare too? I didn't hear you. It was just this, like, weird, red, scary guy. <laughs> and then my dad says, I dreamt the same thing. And I'm eight or nine. I'm just sitting there just eating my toast, looking at them like, what, what the fuck are you talking about? I will never forget that. I'm like, well, what are you talking about? And this is where it gets kind of funny and memey, but... Um, like, weeks later or whatever, Phantom Menace was on TV. <laughs> and I remember them saying, that's what he looked like. Now, that's funny in context, because you're like, they dreamt about Darth Maul. But it's less so funny when it, they had never seen the movie before. Admittedly, Darth Maul does have a kind of a scary look, you know, it kind of looked like the Satan, but, you know, <laughs> Darth Maul, <laughs> mimetic <laughs> contamination. I, I don't know, but it, it was just weird that they had the same dream, and I'll never, and I, I, I asked them years later, like, what was up with that? And like, what, what are you talking about? And I know I didn't dream it. A dream within a dream, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I don't know, man, but it was it was really, really weird. You're still dreaming, wake up. <sighs> what a fucking nightmare. Okay. A meme within a meme, I guess you could say. Okay. I'm not sure if I've explored every... every place, because I think I'm, I'm starting to loop here. Okay. Hmm. Maybe if I head down here, something happens. I'll try. I'll try to do it the the, the doom way, or the quake way. Uh, uh, uh. I want to get into that middle part, but I don't know if I can. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Find the super shotgun. <laughs> okay. Hmm. I like the, I like the step sound. Okay, I guess I'm done in this area, so I guess we'll take another map out. Okay, this is me outside. Oh, it's day now! It's day now! Okay. I guess it does progress. <laughs> Why do I find the, the real world here in the game more scary than the, <laughs> the nightmares or whatever? Yeah. Like, this looks more desolate and empty, you know? <laughs> it's like so quiet, you know? Just like in real life. Jeez, oh my fucking god. My monitor. 
Lord, that scared me something good. The monitor came loose. It's the red man. The monitor came loose and fell over. And the display port outside unhooked itself. And it... Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I gotta fix this. Oh, my Lord. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> sorry about that, everybody. Uh, generally, it just... Fell over, you know. <laughs> what? Watch me scare myself throughout the stream in in really stupid ways. <laughs> Red man alert! <laughs> I have to show you guys this on on screen for for YouTube reasons, but uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. The wasp is coming for me, Joel. Okay. This game has, has me pretty hooked, I gotta say. I, I like exploration in video games. Um, I also like when exploration in video games aren't like... Uh, go here... Um, or else the game won't progress. Maybe that's what the game is. I, I'm too fresh for this. Oh, too fresh. <laughs> I'm too, like, new and green to this to, uh, to actually know, but, uh, you know. So fresh. I'm so fresh. Too much to dip. Okay. Try that world. How many worlds? Oh, <laughs> there's a lot. Let me guess there's a hidden hidden door somewhere here too. Oh. Hmm. You know, I guess I'll do it in a chronological order. Disco world. I love disco world. <laughs> hey buddy. Can I touch? Hey. <laughs> Okay, what about you? Okay. What about these? <laughs> you know what this whole game kind of looks like right now? It looks like... <sighs> if Parappa the Rapper had a migraine. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like, oh god! Okay. Do you know why we stopped the car? Okay. Okay. No. Ooh, ooh. Is this sort of sequence thing here? These things look like the things that are inside your stomach, like uh, beanifying your food. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, what are they called? Uh, not tapeworms, no, I'm talking about like, you know... Wh what are they called? Celia, yes, it's Celia. Okay. Now, I'm gonna state something that might be really obvious for a lot of people, but... Some of these sprites here, with their sort of like, overtly random nature, they... Did Toby Fox take a little bit of inspiration from this? Because I feel like you see that guy and just the sort of... Yeah. I think there's a lot of inspiration that, that, that you know, Delta Rune and Undertale, you know. Are you serious, Joel? Well, you know, I, I never really played this game. I thought this game was like a full-on, like, horror, you know, so... But, but then again... Let's make something perfectly clear. Everything is inspired by something else. <laughs> you know. Like, literally, all heavy metal riffs is just Black Sabbath riffs. In reverse, slow down, fast. You know. <laughs> so if you're saying, like, I had a rip off or whatever. <sighs> man, man, oh man. Don't, out <laughs> don't look outside the your window. <laughs> okay? <laughs> no, different. Okay. 
I, I was not saying like literally, I was saying figuratively how like everything that media wise is just like taking something that is works and like, you know, inspired by, you know. Okay. He laughing now. Okay, every indie game since 2004 has taken a lot of inspiration from this game now. Yeah, the, the influence of this game cannot be ignored. Like, um, I always wanted to play this, but I always felt that this game was too well known and it was like a monumental game. It's it's like, it's like saying, it's not a stupid comparison, right? But it's like, yeah, I've never seen Star Wars, <laughs> you know? And not that you need to, but it's like, you, you know Darth Vader by osmosis and association, but you've never like sat down and really watched it. But, uh, okay. Star Wars took some from Samurai movies. Yeah, speaking of inspiration stuff, like, I mean, George Lucas took more from like, you know, old serials, you know, TV stuff, Flash Gordon. He took stuff from like World War II with the bomber planes, you know. Um, Nothing is original, you know, I'm sorry to say. You know, it really sucks. The, tr the stuff that is truly, truly original, though. Nobody gives a shit about it. <laughs> you know, that's why in, 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 in movies and stuff like that, you will always see the, the remakes, the sequels, the prequels, because it's too much of a risk to come up with something truly original and unique. Yeah. And that's when people say, like, oh, every movie is a remake and stuff like that. Yeah, because like, there's too much money involved. Let's play it safe, you know. So, uh, yeah. Hmm. So if I go here, uh, I heard like this guy. Uh, is it, do you talk? Yes, no, it's uh, a red man alert. Uh, <laughs> I think I want to bring this up to my parents once again. Be like, what was up with that? Okay. Hmm. Yeah, we're definitely looping now. Okay, I'll, I'll go this way and see what happens. Maybe the, one of the walls is hollow or something. I'm, I'm guessing there's a lot of hoo-ha to this. Okay. It's very moonside, yes. Did I go down here? I don't think I did. Uh, head on over here. No, no, no. Okay. You know what I like about this area? It looks like... <laughs> you know what this looks like? It looks. I've, I've seen too many, like, Vinny corruptions. When he plays N64 games, and the game loads wrong, like textures, it just looks like clown vomit, you know? All these walls are like wrong they're sideways you know <laughs> you know clown bar fell. okay i like this little guy reminds me of these uh these little monkeys they have in thailand you know the ones where they like they steal nuts of tourists and stuff like that i don't mean the balls macaques Macaque stealing nuts. <laughs> Funny. Who is who is this man? Check him out. <laughs> who, who, who who's who's this smug guy? He's just a saw that I can't walk on him. Pinball man. Okay, can't really do nothing here. I like him. Hmm. <laughs> Nut status stolen by monkeys. Okay. Pinball man, dude. I don't think this is a new area, though. I think I've been here. Okay. I'm back here now. It's hard to say if I'm done with an area or not in this game. Oh, there's several pinball. Hey, hey, hey. What's going on? No touch. 
All right. Interesting. Hmm. I mean, this game is great and all that, but when do you get the gun? Okay. Next level. Hey, I think we've fully looped around now. Like, we'll find more pinball dudes soon. <laughs> Objective kill. 20 remain. Get the knife. <laughs> Get the knife. Okay. It's time. Okay. I might be done in this area. I'm not sure. Okay. All right. Hmm. This looks like. It looks like it looks like Action 52. I shoot him up. That's not the dog on the game, but this area in particular, it looks so sideways, you know. <laughs> Joel, the knife is real. The knife is real. Okay. Kill me for this. <laughs> you and Nikki remaster 4K. It's time to go into the dream world and fucking kill. Are you ready? Okay. Sorry. There we go. That's better. Kill streak activated. Okay, uh, yeah, I don't know what else I can do in this this area, so I'm guess I'm gonna wake up. But wait a minute, what about my uh, my abilities that I'm getting or effects? I don't have any effects yet. Okay. What else do we have? Different every time, huh? Okay. You have to find them. Huh? Okay. <laughs> I like how the protagonist here goes to bed every night, wakes up, goes back to bed. Man, it's like reflecting real life, you know. Okay. <sighs> you know, it's so it's so mentally taxing to sleep all day, you know. <sighs> I, I gotta I gotta sleep so I can have enough enough energy to sleep some more, you know. <sighs> So we went to Disco World. Yeah. What about this one? Huh? <laughs> but I, I just want to, <laughs> I want to say something. The frame rate thing when I go into doors isn't the game lagging. That's I think it's how it's meant to be. Yeah. Who are you? Okay. <laughs> this game is very much. Uh, Nothing makes sense, but it doesn't have to because it's dreams. So. Okay, it's Red Man. Huh? <laughs> okay. Hey, buddy, do you say or do anything? Huh? Okay, can't really do nothing here. Okay. Uh, what else do we have? We have this little guy. Give us a red man emote. Isn't red man like a rapper or something like that? <laughs> yes, he is. Yes, he is. Isn't he from like Wu Tang Clan? Red man and method man. Guys, when are we getting the inevitable Wu Tang Clan human Nikki crossover? You know. 
I just thought of the, the stupidest crossover ever, you know. <laughs> it might not have, like, Donald Duck met Sephiroth, you know? <laughs> oh, boy! It's a little different, I think, yeah. Hmm, somebody said I missed something. Like, th this is something I can interact with here. There's a door? This right here? Oh! The opposite of good. Okay, well... My poor eyeballs. Okay, is there any space up here? Yes, there is. It's not gonna be that easy, is it? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, if this is hurting your eyes, just, just look away. I'll tell you when it's over. <laughs> okay. You know, here's something fun in Sweden. Um, when there's a static on TV, I mean, not that you'd find static on TV, but, you know, in the 90s and 2000s when CRTs were around. You know what we used to call static on TV? There was nothing on. We used to call it Ant Wars. Because it looks like it's a bunch of ants fighting each other. <laughs> okay. Oh, you did the same! Save and hunger. Really? What? Really? I'm gonna guess that there is more to it because I can maybe go here or up. Okay. For me, it was salt and pepper. <laughs> okay. It was the same in Poland? Huh. We call it a polar bear and a snowstorm. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Okay, there's something here. Okay, can I go left, right, left, right? Up, down. Oh, I'm, I'm so close, probably, right? Joel, fix your monitor. Yeah, it keeps popping over. Okay, yeah. Okay. Someone said, you can do it, King. Is there any sort of, like, visual clues here on what's going on? Or is it just, like, you just have to find this? Okay. No, you just, I guess you just have to. Definitely think that this this way I'm going is, like, a... Like it's, it's bait. Like, you, you might have to, like, go the opposite way. If I go left... If I go up here, hang on. And I go here instead. And if I were to go like left somewhere here, yeah, see what I mean? Yeah, like it's not the obvious. You know? I, I yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. I, I saw I saw it through. I saw it through. Or did I? I got it. Okay. Now we're back in Earthbound Zero. <laughs> right. Uh... <laughs> it really is Earthbound Zero or Mother One. Uh... Oh boy, we're heading to Magic Ant again. Okay. Who's this guy, huh? Are we a friend or... Oh, I like the fact you can't even talk to him. That's good. <laughs> okay. Right. <laughs> the Eye Man. Yo, you just broke into the house, you meanie. Yeah. Okay. This is a huge mace. Okay. Bet there's something in one of these. 
The soundtrack is just a five second loop. Yeah, like Earthbound. Or, well, the first one. Oh, the least out of here. Okay. Okay. So if I go here. Yeah. Okay, if we head here. Oh, what's a sad sad ghost doing here, man? Huh? I'm doing alright? <laughs> oh. Alright, see you later, buddy. Okay, it's a sad little guy. If there's something strange in your dreams. Who you gonna call? Freddy Krueger. Oh, hey man. You are alive. Okay, anything here? Huh? Oh, damn it, come on. <laughs> Get out of the way. Excuse me. Yeah, thanks. Hello? Oni. Did I get a status effect? Oh. Alright. Well, I found a demon in the in the basement. <laughs> Red man alert! Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> Fuck's sake! What that that <laughs> <laughs> That's incredible. That's incredible. I can't believe that. Red man alerts. Okay. So I just want to. I just want to show the stupid shit that happens in chat. <laughs> Yo, can we get a <laughs> pre-recorded? Yes. Red man alert. <laughs> okay. That's incredible. That's incredible, man. Okay. Oh, come on now. Now I'm guessing because I got one of the status, well, not status effects, but uh, what do they call them? The, well, I guess just effects. Can I now do, like, can I backtrack to other areas and use it? Yes. Ah. Uh, how do I use it? Is it the keys or? Hmm. I don't remember if Red Man does anything. Heading up the stairs, I guess. It's one. Let's do anything. Maybe, maybe not something here, but uh, press one. Nope. Oh. Most are just cosmetic. Oh, okay. Baby's first ROM hack. <laughs> okay. Hey, how you guys doing? Let me double check this. A bedroom, uh, yeah, dream world. Finish it. Pinch your cheek, yes. Effects. Uh, you can get rid of the effects in the room of doors. Okay. Waking up in the room, okay. Let's... Okay. This is a reference to what is that game called? Bo Bo Boku something like Wars. What is it called? What are you talking? What is it called? Bokusaka Wars. Is that the one? <laughs> Cash's Castle. Okay. Oh well. Thanks, buddy. See you around. Okay. Hmm. Bokus, Boku, Bokosuka Wars. There, yes, that's what it is. That's the one that has a fantastic game over. Hang on, Bokosuka Wars game over. One of the best. If you've never seen this, it's. <laughs> Here it is. Wow, you lose. <laughs> okay. 
It's even better because I the actual reference here. Uh, where is the where's the guy? Uh, tell you what, I'll just, I'm just gonna show it on screen instead. Unrelated, but I hope I'm, I'm doing an okay job at this game at least because um, you know it, it is is quite a taxing thing to play such a legendary game and like add nothing to it. You know, everybody's played this except me, so I feel like what the fuck can I possibly say about this game that hasn't been analyzed shit or whatever? You know. But I'm playing it just because I like want to see its legacy and and all that stuff. You know, so. But I, I'm guessing that a lot of people haven't played it anyway, you know, it's, it's, uh... It's what it is. Anyway, here's Bokusuka Wars. <laughs> Look at that frame rate, huh? I don't know why, it kind of looks like Peppa Pig, but... <laughs> <laughs> That's a game over. There it is. Yes. Yes. Wow. You lose. <laughs> All right. I think I think the opposite happens if you win. It's like, wow, you win. Okay. I played a ROM hack version of this. Yep, I probably did at some point. Too. Okay, I played Luigi Wars. Yes, I did. Yes, that's what it was. Okay, Bravo, you win. Been here. Have not been in this area yet. This, this episode of Extreme Home Makeover sucks. Move that bus! And what have you done? I looked out of curiosity. Hey, look at this. Out of pure curiosity, I looked up uh, what happened to the, the people that own the house from Extreme Home Makeover. A lot of them sold their houses and advertised basically this. this our house was featured on Extreme Home Makeover, and they wanted like ten million for it. Too. <laughs> and they're like, let's just buy some bungalow. Let's just buy some fucking van that we live out of instead. Just collect all this money and eat beans until. We can't no more, you know. As seen on TV! I know. Hmm. Can I go this way instead? Pimp My Ride 2. Pimp My Ride has one of the funniest, like, things I know. Because it was like... The year was 2002, and I was watching an episode on YouTube, and it, it was really funny because the guy, I think, I, don't, I forgot what the episode was, but it was a while ago. But it was an episode where Exhibit, <laughs> remember Exhibit? The car got a PlayStation 2 in the back. Not YouTube in 2002, no, 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 I'm, let me formulate that better. The show was like 2002, and the PlayStation 2 was brand new, and the episode is on YouTube somewhere. And they get a PlayStation 2 in the back of the car, and they're like, My God! My God! You know. Remember that episode? <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Okay. Yo, dog. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I'm guessing there's something I gotta find here. I'm getting like Secret City vibes from this. I often bring up Secret City from Sven Co-op, but uh, that was the ultimate map to find just like secrets for hours, you know. <laughs> uh, Secret City. It's always weird when I bring these things up because like craters from my childhood when it comes to like gold source games and stuff like that, I'll talk about them and then they like pop into chat be like, hey man, I made that map. I'm like, what? You know, huh? Anything else I missed here, huh? 
This is more of a psychological horror game. I don't know if it, it's a horror game at all. It's it's more of a exploration-y kind of dream thing. You know what I'm gonna try? Now that I have this power, I'm gonna guess that I'm pretty much done with this area. I'm guessing each area is to get one effect and then you can move on. So I think I can go now. Maybe, yeah. Uh, all right. I'll try it. Okay, well, I'm done. I'm guessing that there's gonna be one day I wake up here and the entire sky is like... Blood. <laughs> okay. Off to bed I go. I hate when you sleep for too long and you, like, develop a headache for it. Is that a pipe or is that like a rope going down? Hmm. It's gonna be like the Jetsons, you know, I actually go from the sky down and it's just like, oh, everything looks like Flintstones down here. Okay. Let's try the, the effect here. Recon recon reconstitute as an Oni. Holy shit, I, I just made a Flintstones joke and it's yabba dabba doo immediately. What the hell? All right. I'm the red man. Okay, let's try this one out. You that guy? Okay. Yeah. Hmm. I'm thinking one of the candles do anything, but. This music is a lot like uh, Cave of the Past. Too. I fully expect the Beach Boys to pop in any moment. De All right. Hey, wait a minute. This is we were here before. Oh no, that 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 thing's gonna come for me, isn't it? Oh hell. Okay. Uh oh. Oh man. <laughs> no diagonal going here. But what a friend. No, I don't think so. Okay, I've been there before, so. Uh... Alright. Uh... Run, Joel, run. I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay. Guys, I think my game is glitched. They forgot the floor! <laughs> Look! All the lamps are flying! Ha! <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, so it's zigzag to kind of go up here. I don't know about this you may Nikki stuff. Game's unfinished. Can't play it. It's nowhere near as good as Counter-Strike Source. Uh, I'm sorry guys, but this this gamer is not having enough. This G4 gamer score is gonna give it a big fat no, not recommended. Hello. Take me out of here. Red world alert. Stop it. <laughs> okay. Alright, where are we going here? Now, I'm gonna guess that Yumaniki has a whole salad of fan games based on it. Yes. <laughs> like hundreds. Because here's the thing, I remember Yume Nikki 2 being announced a few years ago. It came out and it was like terrible. Or did I dream that? Too? 
It was like a remake, and it was not very good. That was an official 3D game, and everybody hated it. What was that? It was the 3D game. Imagine if I play that game instead and be like, this is not human icky, what? It is a fan remake, but it is good. I'm getting <laughs> conflicting sources here, you know. You're thinking of Bubsy Joel. Yes, I'm sorry, shit. Oh, damn it, I got boobsit again. Hold on, give me a second. <laughs> yeah, I got boobsit. Yeah, I boobsed it. I boobsed it. You know. Do you guys remember that Bubsy game that came out? It was like 2016. I played it as a joke and I finished it in like one hour and the game just had one world. It had like six levels and the whole game was like a big scam. I used to chime in on the fact that Bubsy was so annoying. <laughs> and the entirety of that stream is just me, me like contemplating, I mean, maybe I shouldn't refund it. Should I? I mean, I, feel, I don't know. Just, for two hours, I was just going back and forth just thinking, should I refund my $10? You know, um, you should have. I don't know. Ooh, uh oh, uh-oh. I'm guessing that's bad. Okay, we don't want to interact with that. Okay. The official remake is called Dream Diary, and it's on the Switch. You have no idea how hard it is for me to, like, not say dairy when I'm reading diary. Because, you know, English is not my native language, and I'm always like, I gotta really, really not screw up here. You know. <laughs> hey, hey, I think we found something here, huh? Dream diarrhea, no? Okay. And yes, chat, antithesis. Antithesis. <laughs> Starts to be one of these streams, huh? All right. Okay. Interesting. Uh, hmm. So go here instead. Uh, when am I doing the Spanish stream? We already did it. You missed it, friend. You missed it. Okay. Uh, this maze is gigantic. Look up a map. Uh, how about we don't look up a map and I just explore for hours? Speaking of, uh, I found the Pokemon ladder, or, well. Okay. Hmm. The stairs, yes, the stairs, sorry. So another thing, escalators, stairs, and ladders are all the same in my head. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Hey, man. How you doing? Uh, eels and escalators. Okay. Interesting. I don't think that, that I might be able to finish this game in one sitting, though, so this might be a potential continuation, kind of like how I'm going to do with Underhill. Uh, Underhill is going to be the next Spooky Saturday, and, uh, um, you know, we we'll, might be able to finish this at some other point, too, because it's, I'm probably going to get lost a lot during this. So... I think what, what, what inspired a lot of people, you know, and, the, well people liking this game so much. I mean, I'm liking it too. But I think the, the cryptic nature of it, and the game never explaining what's up, invites a certain um, fanaticism about it, where, you know, the average player is going to be playing it a lot, and they, like, I'm stuck, and then they find something like, oh my god, nobody else has found this. So, I'm, I'm in a weird way, I think streaming something like this, uh, where a game is just full of secrets and exploration, uh, 
I know that may, this may not be the best game to stream per se, but I don't really mind that. But you know, if you are a say you were one of those like very, uh, very uh, like quick cut YouTube horror people, you know, and they're like, you made Nikki spooky highlights. Whoa, zoom in, zoom out. <laughs> you know, it's like, whoa. <laughs> Yo! Woo! You know. Could you imagine me like? All right, guys, we're in a new area. I had a little face cam, and I do the, uh, you know, I grab my my like this, and I do a big like with my face. <gasps> you know, it's just like, oh my god, guys. Oh my god! Yo! Oh my god! Like and subscribe! MySpace Gaming! <laughs> Sorry. Fatin. <laughs> my brain. Why are you crying? <laughs> Chunky. Okay. What? Is it a puzzle now? Okay. <laughs> I can't tell if he's eating a bread or can I use this? A okay. <laughs> and how do I do something with this? He's eating chips for dinner. <laughs> okay. Hmm. I swear to God, if this game. I had a fart thing, you know. <sighs> hey, let's check out you, you and Nikki tonight. We're really gonna appreciate all the the nuances of this game and you know its legacy. And here it is, like you know, two hours in. I'm just like, haha, guys, jokes. You know, you may Nikki, more like you may stinky. Check me out on Facebook. Yeah. Okay, uh, MySpace Gaming. Speaking of MySpace, whatever, like, MySpace for a while became like a music portal for bands, and now I don't know what the hell MySpace is. It's dead. It's dead. It doesn't exist. Still is, but nobody uses it. I'm not very funny tonight, right? I'm not very funny at all, but... Hey guys. Uh, like, uh, let's check out this new uh, horror game about MySpace. You know, haha. Jesus Christ. Stolen joke from chat. Chat, if you're saying that I steal jokes from you guys, each time you rate my jokes and you say minus two, <laughs> you're saying that you, you're not funny either, so. <laughs> who's, who's the clown now, huh? Damn. You're goddamn right. Okay. Okay, I don't know if that was the entire area though, but uh, we'll see. Yeah. Okay. Now I know it's a little early to speculate or <laughs> speculate. Uh, knowing this game's ginormous legacy and all that. I'm curious, uh, does this game have, like, 
a message or does this game ever like really be like okay here's what this is actually about then all this meant this or is it all completely interpretive yeah. no nothing you will see you'll see joel okay um Tell you one thing about dreams and me, uh, I can literally not eat pizza before bed. Uh, if I eat a slice of pizza before it, I will have nightmares for real. Uh. I, I'm dead serious. Uh. And they're horrific nightmares too. They're not like just, oh no, the ghost, haha, you know. It's like dreams where I die. <laughs> not a pizza, mind you, but you know, the kind of dreams that are just absolutely horrible. Uh. And it, it, it's kind of the weird dreams for like, not that like it's an explicit gory death or anything like it. It's more like a sad death. Like in the dream, I die and I'm a ghost and I will see the people around me mourning. Shit like that. And then I actually wake up like, oh, fuck that, man. You know, it's crazy. You know, that, that kind of stuff. And in the in the dream, it feels so real. Like, it's like oh, I'm dead now, you know. It's like that movie, uh, Ghost Story, you know? Been here, though. I sometimes have this crazy, crazy reoccurring dream, too. And, um... It's not, it's not like, a, like a pizza nightmare, but... Uh, it's sort of like that. Um... I'm dreaming that um, my parents aren't home uh, in the house, uh, and uh, well, essentially, there's these things that are trying to like get at me. Um, but luckily, um, in the dream, <laughs> I've set these traps off. I'm trying to fucking say hell alone. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I was trying to see how long I can bullshit you guys. Okay. And I look myself in the mirror. I see my own face. I look like a little Steve Buscemi. Mom comes home and I say, Mom, what's my name? And she goes, Of course, you're Makulki Kulkin. And I say, Oh shit, and I wake up. All right. Right. But why? <laughs> right. Joel wanna eat pizza before bed. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hang on, what's this? So don't talk about them on stream. You might end up in a shitty fan footage type documentary that will have a budget of about 3,000 and earn 10k in the box office. <laughs> okay. You know what was a great horror movie? Um... Cabin in the Woods. Was this like complete meta movie with like, yeah, we know we're in a horror movie and we're gonna like play with the uh, the stereotypes and like great great movie. Really like that one. I guess you know sometimes I would argue that a movie like that isn't really horror. It's more like a a bloody bloody fun ride, and I don't mean that in like a British way, you know. Speaking of bloody, bloody good time, bloody, bloody, uh, I was 
looking up uh, Maxwell Silver Hammer by the Beatles. And the song Hammer Smashed Face by Cannibal Corpse and Maxwell Silver Hammer is nearly about the same thing. <laughs> Can I show you guys something incredible real quick? Yeah. It's this outtake, because if you don't know, Maxwell Silver Hammer was uh, infamously like hard to record. Like um, they did like a million takes and it, like it drove everybody insane. Uh, and I saw this outtake from the studio and it is, it is fantastic. Watch this. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> Paul's body here is sideways. <laughs> what the? You know what it kind of reminds me of? A little bit. I'm sorry that we're like, dude, just get on with the fucking game. But he, he kind of has energy of, of this going on. You know, like this is some similarities. <laughs> <laughs> he, he sort of has uh, slight uh, vibes of. Hang on. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What if this was Beatles' actual legacy? It's like, you know, you show an alien, like, this is the Beatles, like, you know, probably the most, like, f famous and best-selling rock artist group of all time, and, like, show me, and somehow, like, the, the cultural archives have been replaced and fucked with, and this is the th first thing they hear. Clang, clang, Maxwell, this is what you humans like? This? <laughs> okay. It's beautiful. Beautiful. Ironically, I, I, I <laughs> oh, that joke's mean. That joke's fucking mean. <laughs> I was gonna say. <laughs> they, they show the aliens Yoko Ono's discography and they're like, Oh, but this actually bops. I like this. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. One leg, yeah. Okay. Hmm. One hand, please. Eye palm. Okay. Let's try it out. Too. Warp into an eye palm. Oh, okay. Right. I'm doing fine. Okay. <laughs> Your right hand comes off. Mr. Kennedy. Whoa. Okay, you can just go back, huh? What else if I do it multiple times? Uh, no way, bro. Okay. No, I'm not gonna do that joke. That joke is so stupid. No, 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 no. Where? <laughs>
mean, I'm better than this. No, I'm not. Hey, you. You're finally awake. <sighs> Excuse me. That joke was terrible, like it. But it did look pretty smooth, didn't it? Okay, yeah. Uh. All right. <laughs> Don't look that great, but uh, sure thing. What's this? More ice. Uh, hold. Go left. Go left. All right. Uh, graphics. Uh, you know, what this, you know what this level looks like? It looks like baby's first... <laughs> it looks like baby's first... <laughs> Mario Maker level. Oh, what's this? Bicycle. Okay. Mount the bicycle. Alright, look at this! Bicycle, bicycle. Now I'm doing that thing where you're stepping on tiles in real life when you're like uh, walking, and you're stepping on like left, right, left, right. Ha ha ha. I still do stuff like that, man. Okay. So it's like I wonder, I wonder if Emma's gonna like catch me and be like, "What are you doing? Oh, what's this?" Maybe because I'm on the bike here. Hang on. Oh. I refuse to do the farm with reverb. I. I refuse. Diffused. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Can you ride the bike through the entire game? I feel like if you do that, you're probably not stopping by to really appreciate what's going on here, but. Uh, yeah, you can, huh? Alright. That's the way I came from, I know that. Okay. Anything else here I can get? Or is it just repeating at this point? Hmm. What's that in the background? Looks like... <laughs> it looks wrong. Okay. Was this all made by one person, by the way? Yeah. It wasn't like a little team? All of it. I gotta say, though, this game is free. Uh, if you want to play this yourself and give it a try and see what this game is all about. Um, I, ho I hope the the creator uh, earned some money off it, at least. Uh, you know? Uh, hope it didn't get red bubbled. <clears throat> Check this out, too. It did. Nobody really knows a lot about the crater. 
What else did the crater make here? Okay. Nothing. It was just this here. Interesting, yeah. That certainly adds to the mystique of the game, you know. I, I just had a horrible thought. Maybe they, they, they're going under a synonym, and when they're done with all of it, it's just like Miyamoto. <laughs> it's just Miyamoto in a mask. <laughs> like a Joker mask takes it off. <laughs> Back to making the Wii Bowling 5. Okay. <laughs> Got him again. Oh, hey, man. Blonde. Okay. It looks like I have a potato sack on my head. <laughs> okay. I can sit. Can I sit in the blood? Okay. Yeah. Hmm. I'm sitting. What is this? Excuse me. Can I? S Hang on. I wonder if I can do this. Get on the bicycle and then. <gasps> oh yes. Okay. What is this game? Uh, this game is called Yumi Nikki, and it is a super classic in the uh, indie horror thing. It's, it came out in 2004, and it is like the uh, the primordial ooze, the beginnings of a lot of games that's indie horror now, you know. Okay, yeah. Can I do something with this this little block here? Yeah, this is Yumaniki, yeah, and uh, a lot of people thought that, that me playing this game at first was a prank. Yeah. Like, I, do, would I actually do this? And, yeah, I am. I uh, I, I really want to see what this game is all about, you know. And I, I really like it. I really really like it. I like the fact that again, I'm a little late to the party, <laughs> but uh, I like the fact that this game at no point tells you what to do. It is completely up to you to kind of like get anything from it. Okay, I can't go down that thing. Huh? This feels like a like a Moby track that's about to kick in with like. It sounds like the bit the back into a Pink Floyd song, yeah. How is Moby these days? Bald? I don't know. Is this the is this the entirety of this? Did I miss anything? I don't think I can find anything else. These guys look like half half finished bionicles. <laughs> okay, yeah. I just learned that in America and Canada, they they have Lego candy. Ooh, what's this? Oh, Lego is candy. Shut up. <laughs> it's apparently candy you can stack and make things in, but uh, apparently it's the, the worst thing ever for your teeth. Uh. What's this? Oh, okay. Wow. 
subscribe to. Sewer surfing here. Oh, hey, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually got spooked by that. We all float down here. And I else think that Tim Curry as like, you know, Pennywise is, is hysterical. Like I, I don't feel any dread from him. I'm just like, this is Tim Curry joking around. <laughs> okay, sinkfunny.com, everybody. Speaking of Tim Curry, everybody, check back tomorrow. Yes, now it makes sense. Oh. Right. Oh, it moves. <laughs> right, I'm being shown a lot of stuff here, but... Uh... Uh, the Red Man. Okay. Apparently, I'm supposed to be using the hand effect here. Again, I would have never guessed what to do here, so. Okay. Is this. No? One guy, the trolled. Ah, okay. <laughs> Guess we're doing that again then. At least we know where to go, so. Okay. It was somewhere up here, I think, yeah. Hmm. Anyone know what this game is? Uh, this is Call of Duty Warzone 5. Is with the DLC. I'm playing with the RGB add-on, you know. We're doing a racer, a Call of Duty giveaway later on in chat. So, give us you, my Nikki. <laughs> Does chatter hate this too? <laughs> we have a we have a we have a better Twitch TV emote in chat called Pet the Mods. And whenever Chatter comes in here and says Chatter things, just tickle him. <laughs> just go tickle him. There it is. <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> Pet the mods. Okay. Now I'm a little lost again here. I guess if you go right, it's sort of like. The map loops in certain areas, but I'm not exactly sure which one is which. Uh, if I go up here, maybe. Uh, there it is, there it is. Hey, should I go right instead? Yeah. It's all about exploration anyway, so like losing progress is... Right. Hmm. The bean. The trash. Have you really streamed Yumi Nikki for, for almost three hours now? It felt like I started ten minutes ago. <laughs> Are you serious? Tom really flies with this game, huh? Okay. Almost two hours. Uh. Okay. <laughs> Joel's mind is going. Uh. Okay. Is this Joel's first playthrough, Yuminiki? Yes, I've never played this before. It's my first time ever with this, actually. So, um... So, they can check out here? No. This, this, this area is unnerving. <laughs> I gotta say. Okay, uh... It's that sound, man. Uh, faceless ghost. Okay. 
materialize as a faceless ghost. You get the point. <laughs> okay. Ah. Okay. Huh. Zero effort. Friend effect. If I do this, so. so this guy, you're not meant to use the hand on this guy, yeah. Okay. Hmm. As we're heading right to. Oh, all right. What is this? Like Spider-Man? Clap your thighs. Yeah. Yes, sir. Are you a friend or an enemy here? Oh, hey, man. Uh, all right. Hey, we're back here. Okay, you, you can't tell me that guy is not adorable. Look at that guy, huh? Huh? <laughs> Onion. <laughs> Onion, son. Okay. That's that's the inspiration for Lancer, <laughs> is it really? No. There's a lot of stuff here that does have this like quasi like, which would later inspire some of the art in in, in Undertale. Like I, I can't not acknowledge that. You know, a lot of the, uh, you know, it very very much very much. You know, it's like it reminds me of Waterfall a little bit. You know. Uh, Oh, what's this? Oh, I gotta get off the bike, yeah. I'll be the faceless ghost. Is that something I gotta do here? Uh... No money? Oh, and I gotta get some money, huh? Okay, yeah. I feel the dudes that are scribbled, these creatures or whatever, they, they remind me of the stuff I used to scribble uh, on my high school math books. Of just like... Mental vomit dudes, <laughs> you know? It's like... But they had they, they had more like swords. And like hats and stuff, yeah. <laughs> you know? Back here, huh? Okay, yeah. So this leads back. Yeah. Anything I can do here? Yeah. Sounds like a train station or something. Go in. Uh. But, um, do you get the money outside or inside? You do it outside, huh? Okay, anywhere, huh? Okay, yeah. Uh. You get money through murder. <laughs> I like in, in San Andreas, if you're playing as Fat G CJ, um, when you kill people, Fat CJ goes, give my lunch money. Okay. Can I go up here and to the left? Anything else? Yeah. Vineyard tonight. Yes, this is the start of the the Vineyard Marathon. In fact, uh, so after the stream, we're gonna get a lot of Halloween movies. Okay. 
<laughs> not here. One of the greatest lines is in San Andreas, like it doesn't matter what version of CG it is, but if you fall out of like a plane or you jump and you don't have a parachute, CG goes, I fucking hate gravity! <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> okay. I think I might be done with this area. You know what? I'm gonna head back. I'm gonna switch over to uh, switch over to the eye palm. Go back to the red guy? Go back to the red guy? Again? Go to the red guy? There's more to do there? Okay. If you say so. Go in his mouth. We did that. We did that. Again? Okay, you missed things. Okay. Alright. I'm trying to get the look for the money or whatever. You know, huh? Hmm. I'll try. It's a really ominous soundtrack right now. So now I can just... Go. Oh, it's blocked off. I see. Okay. Ah, right. <laughs> I wonder if there's anything else I can do up here. Huh? No, I think that's it. All right, lead on. A little Fisher guy or something. Look at that guy. Huh? Oh, there is more. There is more stuff, huh? I love that guy. Huh? Joe, you barely explored. Oh, you're saying that the previous area before I went into the the place here is more explorable. Ah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I thought it was just the teleportation here, but... Okay, gotcha. Okay. Ride the bike, yeah. I'm kind of lamenting that, you know, winter is fully here in Sweden. Like, we don't really... We have such a f small fall. Um, and... Uh, oh, shit, okay, you can't even go back here, okay. We have such a small fall, and uh, when winter comes, it's gonna be up for a very long time. And I'm one of the brave people that I, I use my bike um, when it's ice and snow. And uh, I don't look forward to that, because it's always a gamble. I hate falling like a jackass in public. It is the worst feeling. Because very little times do people actually have any sympathy. They just stare at like some fucking like vultures. They just like... Huh. It's like, fuck. Very, very few times there's people like, oh shit, you okay? You know? Just, just feel embarrassed. You're like, oh fucking hell. Tala för dig själv, Norrlänning. Här i Stockholm är det hårt väder. Ja. Jag byter gärna. Jag byter fan gärna. Men vad fan. Men det var ju fan typ 10, minus 10 grader här. Uh, typ en vecka som svinkallt och fan svinkallt utöver det uh, så var det alltså det, 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 det typ det var fullt liksom februari väder här sorry I, somebody, somebody was giving me shit from Stockholm saying it's, it's shorts weather here down you know where we live <laughs> but you know fake language ah Okay, uh, now let's explore this area. Cube, defender of the polyverse. Oh, okay. Can we go back? Yes, we can. Oh, well, uh... Speaking of Lego, uh... <laughs> Okay, well... Uh... Hmm... I uh... wonder if we can get any money from this place, perhaps. Uh... We'll see, yeah. Uh... 
Someone in chat says, have you seen the have you seen the Lego porno, Joel? No, I have not seen the Lego porno. So, sometimes you, you guys like it. Like I would know these things. <laughs> okay, I don't know what the, the hell the Lego porno looks like, but I I'll tell you what. That's already been done, okay? You guys remember Lego Creator Movie? What was it called? Hang on. Lego... Lego Movies. Lego Movie Maker. Was that it? Lego Movie Maker. What the fuck was it called? Yeah. Fuck, that, that That Lego Movie ruined everything. I can't ever find out what the hell I was... What was it called? The Steven Spielberg. Yes, yes. What was it called? Steven Spielberg. Was it Lego Creator? Lego Studios, yes! This is the one I had. This is the one I had. Right? <laughs> Great real movies. And I'm just saying, was the porno shot on this? <laughs> Put the web camera? How this worked? You got a little web camera, and it was just like frame by frame by frame, you know? Either this joke can go two ways. Either this was done with real actors, or it was just two little Lego people. <laughs> okay. Hat and scarf. Okay. All right. Speaking of cold in Sweden, you know. Uh, hat. Uh, okay. Uh, anything else? Uh, anything else? Uh, something up here, I think. Yeah. Oh, look at this! I found something. Oh, it's just a tunnel. Just a tunnel. Okay. Joel, did you have Bionicles? I absolutely had Bionicles, man. Okay. I even had Bionicles before they were called Bionicles. They were called Lego... God, I forgot what they were called. Like, they had discs they threw. Slicer. There we go. Yes. Throwbots, <laughs> throwbots. Yeah, why not? Uh, okay, slicers. Uh, okay. Bionicle lore discussion stream when? You, you just check out Josh's channel. That's all he cares about. Bionicles. Uh, <laughs> I think I think my my as a kid I I my excitement for Bionicle officially ended when I got the. Bionicle movie because uh, that was the moment I realized okay this is a little goofy like somehow I don't know why I justified it this way but like the, the, the Bionicle that I had in my head they never spoke and it was just like really mythical cool thing you know Bionicle and then in the movie it's like yeah we're gonna have a soccer match and I'm just like fuck this <laughs> sleepy No. <laughs> T yes. Oh god. Is that thing coming for me? Right. Do you just over and over again? Huh. That's not the same thing in the background, is it? Uh, I think that there might not be much else to it. Uh. Well, it's the same thing. Uh. Okay. Been there. So we're heading. 
Church, church beats. Joel, wear the hat and talk to the floating hat. The floating hat. Well, uh, I think I've seen the floating hat, have I? Well, the door's back here, but. Uh, okay, <laughs> probably shouldn't have done that. No, 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 we're back, we're back. It's just a little shortcut. Ah. Uh, okay. So far, my favorite place has probably been the, uh, the Mother One zone. You know, uh, you interacted with it earlier. Uh, have you seen the snow world yet? I have not. Uh, just a little bike ride through the void. You know, normal things. Uh, you have to find the other... There's another bed here, huh? Okay. Okay. Hmm. Looks like the Info Grames logo. I always thought it was Info Games, but it is Grames. <laughs> it's like Diddy's Kong Quest. It's not Diddy Kong Quest, it's Diddy's Kong Quest. Okay, yeah. <laughs> what the hell is a Graham? Here's a Graham from Infogrames. Uh, haven't seen this area yet. Okay, yeah. Uh, hey, what's this? Oh, not again. Not again. It's Yumi Nikki. Oh, here we go. Yes. Okay, okay. Had a scarf. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. Huh. Modotsuki. Sorry, that's... No. Okay, uh... Hmm... The, the, the hat thing was down here, right? Uh, keep trying, there's a bunch of outcomes. Okay. It's like down here, right? Uh, yes, okay. Hey, 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 what's, what's poppin'? Guess not. <laughs> Guess I gotta try different, different times. Uh, you can glitch the bike to go quicker. Really? Huh? It's random. Okay, we're gonna have the worst luck, right? Uh, this is new. This is new. Uh, Okay. Uh, we're back here. Now I'm a little lost, unfortunately, so... You know. <laughs> okay. But how do you... How do you do the, the bike glitch? Let me guess. <laughs> well, first you gotta open up the hex editor, and then... And then... And then... <laughs> okay, yeah. Uh. But first... Okay, yeah. Uh. Who's this guy, huh? That was not there before, was it? Okay, go into a chair in a room while in chair, use bike. Yeah. You know what? I'm gonna do that right now. I'm gonna do that right now. <laughs> I'm gonna see what the hell happens. Okay, I palm. And. Okay, and if I go back. I head here. So we do this. And then I use the bike. 
Oh, oh, fuck. All right. Okay. Nyom. All right. <laughs> it's not how it's meant to be played. Okay, you know, I don't even mind it that much, though. Especially how big this game is. But it kind of breaks the game in a way. I, I, I do acknowledge that. Okay. Haven't been here yet. Okay. So we've been here. There's an even faster glitch? Really? Okay. Top of the exploring a little bit. Let's try this again. You can keep speeding it up if you do it multiple times. Really. You can get bizarrely fast. <laughs> imagine, imagine Yume Nikki like <laughs> speed run <laughs> and time. Everybody starts clapping in the audience, like, wow! It has been done. It has been done. Well, alright. Yes! Look at this! Now I'm up here. Okay. Right. <laughs> Wacky world. Okay, I'm gonna hop on the bike still, but uh, I'm not gonna do the, the the fast glitch. Okay. I'm guessing you need all the status effects to actually like quote unquote beat the game, but. Uh, Okay, yes. How many do I have? I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, the tutorial doesn't count at six. But. Hey, man. Has anybody here ever seen Kingdom of Loathing? <laughs> Reminds me a little bit of that. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, hey. How you doing? Huh? Huh? <laughs> hey, move! Move! Huh. <laughs> Maybe I should, like, take off the bike here. Yeah. Can I talk here? Yeah? Maybe I need some sort of effect for this. Hmm. No, not that, not that either. Yeah. Nothing, huh? It's an effect you don't have, even have yet. Okay, okay. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Check, check out this guy with the the eyeball. Yeah. No face from Spirit of the Way. You know what's funny? You you bring that up because the first time I saw Spirit of the Way, I did not get the big deal. I was just confused by the movie. Like I recognized that it was beautifully done, but I'm like, I don't get the story. I'm just like, ah. And in a way, it reminds me a little bit of this. Like it was just, I'm here for the ride, man. But I don't really get what's happening. He didn't get it. Yeah, I'm sorry. I I, <laughs> I thought the animation was once again great, but I was just eh. Okay. You have to be there. <laughs> Michael Bay child. Ah. That's the, what the problem was. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Been there. Maybe if you go the other way, something else happens. 
Oh, yes, it does actually. Well, guess this this person is just stuck there. Huh? Hey, unrelated guys, but uh, hope you've all uh, adjusted your daylight savings because uh, again, tomorrow is Halloween, and at least in Sweden we we change it there. Uh, I think it's the same in America. That's your tip of the day. Huh? Free hour. Huh? All of Europe does, uh, but not America. Okay. One extra hour of sleep, everybody. Hey, it's you again. Do you, do you need a status effect that I don't have yet? Uh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> Where do I buy daylight? Uh, okay, I haven't seen that guy yet. No, no, no. That, there. Can I get in there somehow? I think I... Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Wait, that's the way I came from. What am I talking about? Uh, Joel, there's a random chance if you enter and re-exit the room, you can collect that shit coin that lets you meet Pee Pee Poo Poo Man later, you know? I started reading your comment and I was generally like, oh, okay, and then it just, it fell apart like glass immediately, you know? <laughs> Hope you're proud I, I got to read your comment, you know? A lot of people are desperately wanting me to read their comments about like, here's what you do, Joel, here's how you get that item. But uh, you were the lucky one tonight. Hmm. I might have... Have I explored every area here? I don't think so. Okay, now, now we're really in the desert. Too. Okay. It's not a joke, it's legit. Ah. Here we go. Here we go. Now we're somewhere. I think we're back here, actually. Hmm. That's how the number one speedrun speedrunner did it. Right, right. Of course he did. You need another effect here. Uh, need another effect to do much here, Joe. Okay. Uh, I guess we're heading back then. Uh, but then again, I did I did get an effect, so uh, you know. But I don't have quite I don't quite have it yet. So okay, well I guess we're heading home. Um, all right. Uh, here we go. Set inside. Uh, um, let's let's head on back. Here. And then let's head to the the red door. I haven't been here yet, so. Uh. Okay. Uh. That does something, but I don't know what it does. Uh. Hmm. So you know you put the, your name twice in the ticker. I, I saw that. I saw that. Yes. I was gonna say like I double the scary tonight, but uh, you know, Joel, Joel. That's right. Uh, love to ride my bicycle. Love to ride my bike. It. I've always wondered, is that song, by the way, that's a skybox outside the the apartment complex, I think. Um, I was gonna say, is, is the bicycle song by Queen a euphemism? Is it some sort of like 70s rock thing where they were talking about something else? Or is it literally Freddy just wants to ride his bicycle? It's a sexual thing, huh? Aha. Uh -huh. I know fat bottom girls is quite more literal in that way, but okay. It's about how he doesn't like Star Wars. <laughs> okay, maybe if 
if I turn the light on and something happens. Uh, hmm. Ben here and Ben here. How awful would this game been if like it was nothing but jump scares? <laughs> You go around, you collect jump scares. All right. Okay. I'm guessing I might need a status effect here. Like, hmm. I don't think I quite have that yet. So. Uh. You need a knife. A lot of people are mentioning this knife, and I, I I thought it was a joke at first, but you really need a knife in this game, huh? Yes, I, I thought you were guys were just joking around. Really? Yeah. Where can I find this bike? Yeah. You need a knife, and you murder NPCs for money. You guys are not fucking joking about this. The knife is a really useful effect. When has Chad ever gaslighted like that? You need a rocket launcher. <laughs> Unrelated, but I brought a fantastical uh, soda pop. Have you guys ever had the Fanta Grapefruit Toronja? Grapefruit flavored soda. You guys ever had this one? This one is fantastic. Yeah. Very, very nice. It sucks. It sucks. No, this this one is fantastic. It's a very adult flavor, you know. Not a lot of people like grapefruit because it's bitter and it's awful. But uh, you know, Toronha, Toronha, Toronha. Fuck grapefruit. I all my home is great. Hate grapefruit. Now, girls, you're actually losing weight while you're sucking his dick. Okay. Yeah. Um, all right. So apparently the knife is in the room we were just at. Okay. You need a lamp. <laughs> Think I need a lamp? <laughs> Not with X split. Oh my god, I was just making a joke, and it actually What the? <laughs> well... Cheating, huh? The Red Man. Okay, huh? Hmm. I don't think I'm supposed to do anything here either uh, until I have, you know. Uh, so where would I get the lamp? The, not that this game is a fetch quest adventure or anything like that, but uh, you know. Uh, hmm. In the lighthouse here, world you were in with all the lamps. That's really early, isn't it? Like, uh, was it here? No, that this is not it. Uh, the lighthouse world, uh, not here. No, that wasn't it either. Um, that was it. Was there? I guess. So, so this was the way. That was, in fact, it. Okay. All right. So let's get on the bike. Yeah. I guess these numbers mean nothing. They're just there to confuse you. But again, I feel confu confusing you in a game like this. That's a bit of an oxymoron. It's like a catch-22, yeah, I guess. Hey, wait a minute. It's this guy. I'm guessing if I had a knife, I could stab this guy to death and get to the secret door. <laughs> I'm guessing. Actually, I haven't... Uh been in this area at all though new stuff uh, new stuff I'm finding out 
Okay. Sort of a spoiler. Huh? Yes, yes. Okay. So I need a lamp here. Wait, where would I find this? Hmm. Missing one of these. Uh, one of these lamps give you something. Hmm. <laughs> I feel uh, the numbers confused. You're always confused. <laughs> Apparently, the lamp I'm looking for is different from the rest. So. Alright. So. It's a very distinct looking lamp. There's no reason to look for the. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Watch me lose it anyway. <laughs> I'm guessing playing this game somehow in widescreen would ruin it. Too. Blind. Okay. Blind. <laughs> I, I, I seriously missed it. No, you're joking, man. You are joking. Blind. Okay, now, now, funny guys. He 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 he. Just find it. All right. Well, been there, been there. He cannot see. So it's an NPC lamp. It's a little different, huh? Is it down here, perhaps? Like, in between all this stuff? Yeah. Hang on. Huh? Bend there. And I bend there. Hmm. See, it's, it's a little confusing right now. Maybe, maybe the lamp I'm looking for does look like everything else, but there's like a specific frame where there's like a guy behind it that's like, haha, can't get me, or whatever. I wonder if the lamp just moves around, you know, and I used to not seeing it. Hmm. It's a funny looking lamp. Oh. It's tiny and it moves around. Okay. Joel would make will make for a bath bad moth excuse you <laughs> I miss moths flying in the summer they just come in and like eat your socks dude can't find lamp okay I've been there I'm gonna, gonna go straight down here maybe something happens I just can't find this thing, man. Hmm. Been there. Been there. Been there. Did a full, full on. I'm gonna go left, see if anything happens here. That goes there, okay. Background music gets a little loud. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Go left here, I suppose. Sorry, I'm just enjoying my grapefruit beverage here. Fun fact, the only reason I really brought this thing up is that it's a American soda, because I'm looking at the back of it, it's got that, like, American design. A product of the Coca-Cola company? What? I thought Fanta was, like... Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're right. Coke uh, owns Sprite as well. Sprite and Fanta. I, th I thought, like, maybe Fanta was, like, under, like, Pepsi. <laughs> Coca-Cola. Coke makes water. Yeah, isn't that the, the Sony or whatever? 
You ever had Mongo Pepsi? I have. It's pretty good. Yeah. Root beer. Spurt. <laughs> okay, yeah. Coke owns like 50% of all beverages. Yeah. Are you telling me that Nestle, yeah, the guys who make the, the funny chocolate uh, cereal, yeah, you're saying that they make more stuff? What? I love Nestle Crunch. Nestle and Coke are evil. What? Huh. I think I might have passed the, the lamp. I missed it. <laughs> Shit. Uh, I really did. Oh, no. <gasps> there it is. Wait a minute. I've been here. Uh. Oh, damn it. Is there a... Hmm. <laughs> Wrong lamp? Are you serious? There's another lamp? It's not even a smaller lamp. Oh. Alright. The lamp has shoes. <laughs> Excuse me? Straight out of Earthbound. Yeah. It's microscopic. Yeah. Okay. It's a small lamp that walks around. Yeah. I'm really curious how this looping system works, because it's... It really confuses you. It really confuses you. We've been here. Okay, yeah. He's a little funny guy with shoes. Okay, yeah. It's just <laughs> one dead pixel. Uh-huh. Ben there. Okay, you are the lamp. Uh. It's a default thing you can do with RPG Maker. It's pretty simple stuff. I had no idea about that. Uh, you know. I even made a game once in RPG Maker, but... You know. Shite game. Okay. Some people that still really enjoy Barbecue Quest like, Man, that's so awesome, man. <sighs> Joel, you have any funny stories from college? No, because I feel that college is when, when you've, you've grown up too much and there's nothing fun left. <laughs> you know, it's like, yeah, it's a hysterical story, man. I I woke up and I hate lunch. I went home and slept. <laughs> it's like, there's nothing to it. Yeah. That's dark. Well, it's reality, and unfortunately reality is kind of dark. You know. Okay, so we've been here. That leads there. Okay, yeah. It's like a fucking giant area, this place. Where the hell is this little shoe guy? Where shoe nice? Where is he? Man. Okay, yeah. Hmm. Lamp. Hmm. It's hard to say, man. Uh, uh, uh. Where is it? Okay. Joe, you missed it five times. Uh huh. He's gonna appear on screen in five seconds. One. Two. Three. Four. Four and a half. Four. Almost. Four quarter E. Darius! <gasps> Five! Lamp. Yeah. <laughs> and time. All right. 
I can't believe that actually sort of worked. <laughs> Unbelievable timing, man. Unbelievable timing. Okay, yeah. What's that area? Was it the the red one that had the darkness in it? Yes, okay. Yeah. Actually, this one is not... Uh, maybe I gotta talk them with the lamp, like... Uh, oh, we are the same. Uh, hello. Uh, <laughs> creepy place, man. Uh, okay. Uh, it's this one, right? Uh, ah! Okay. Interesting, yeah. Oh, hey man, how you doing? Uh, I guess I can talk to him, but... Uh, hmm. You'll get the knife. We're trying to get the knife here, but, uh, you know... Uh, are you okay? You sound a little lightheaded. Lightheaded. How do I sound lightheaded? Okay. Hmm. <laughs> I'm heavy headed today. Yeah. Oh, for fight's a pun! F oh, Jesus! End the stream! Oh, that. Dude, I got. Dude, I, not even since that, that, that like, Sugmacon from that Half Life Hazard quote. That, that genuinely fucking got me! Oh my god! Oh, that is so embarrassing! Oh! 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 oh fucking. I. I uh, Jesus! I thought it was. Because I was just. I was just wondering tonight, like, like uh, what? What do you mean? And then, oh, that is fucking embarrassing. Oh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> no electricity in the brain. Oh, oh dude. I... <sighs> when I upload this on YouTube, there's going to be a sudden cut where I'm just like lightheaded. And it just like cuts to, all right, everybody. Hey, that was really weird. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oof. Ooh. Glad I had that on the soundboard. I never use it. Okay. Hey, there it is. Uh, kitchen knife. Uh, so now I can just go around stabbing people. Uh, Okay, yeah. I don't want to kill the blue guy, though. So funny. I like that guy, you know? I love that guy. Never heard him, man. Okay, I'm coming for him. You know, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. That guy gets to... That get, he gets to live, man. All right. Now we're gonna head back into the numbers world, which was over here. I keep forgetting. Nope. This was the. Was it Disco World? No, this is the wrong one too. This right. This is one. Yep. Okay. Now. Remember where this is. Can people memorize what the maps are in this game? Like, be like, oh, you just go left, up, up. Like, I, I know you guys are, like, joking around, but it's so confusing. Well, hey, what am I talking about? Maybe not. Kitchen knife. Equip a kitchen knife. And... Oh. Oh, no. All right. Uh. <laughs> it's it's kind of like the uh, 
Happy, happy village. Oops, all murder. The Game Boy Advance thing? You know, if, if I wasn't so lazy, I'd probably put in a Call of Duty joke, too. That's the money, huh? <laughs> All right. Somebody melted a Smurf over here. All right. Can I kill every single enemy in here? I guess I can. <laughs> yes, but why? <laughs> I mean... I slaughtered them like animals! <laughs> That's a lot of money I can, you know... Stab a wall. <laughs> stab a wall? I can do that? Too. See, see, the jokey comments are now, like, half real. Okay. Okay. There's actually a wall you can stand, but it's not here. Okay. It was all a dream. Super Nintendo Sega Genesis. When I was stabbing people, couldn't picture this. Okay, stab the zipper on the wall. I can try these up here too, but... Okay, you know what I love about the, uh, the music video? It's the fact that Biggie is playing S Street Fighter 2 on like Sega Genesis. <laughs> on a huge CRT television. It's awesome. <laughs> Nothing here, okay. Yeah, sorry, boys. Hey, man. <laughs> Jesus. All right, now that we have that, uh... is it? Is it... where is it? I wonder. Um, oh, by these. Uh... Joel, have you seen the clip where Ye Sunday farts on stream louder than he thought it would be? <laughs> this stream has been a emotional sort of whiplash. One moment it's like, oh, what are we doing? And it's like, oh, this is really neat. Suddenly it's comments like that, you know. So the wall I need to stab is a little different, apparently, yeah. Okay, haven't been here, have I? No, I don't think I've been here, huh? There's a bunch of beds. Um, right. Hey, how you doing? Doing all right? <laughs> uh oh. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> I think we're stuck here. Okay. Okay, we're going to eye palm it. Hang on. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Oh no, it's murder. 
try this again. So one of the zipper walls here. Apparently it doesn't smile, and that's the one we gotta stab. There it is. Is that it? Hang on. Yes, it is. Okay. <laughs> Man, if this game came out in 2004, and there was no, like, wikis about the game or anything like that, and this was just, like, a word-of-mouth thing from Japan, I, I get why this was so mysterious and so, like, intriguing to play, you know? But, uh... Yeah. <laughs> hey, how you doing that? Huh? <laughs> Later, dude. Sorry. What was the guy? Who was the guy who painted cats? And he had some mental thing that um, it got worse and worse. Uh, bitrate zone. Van Gogh. No, it wasn't Van Gogh. Uh, hang on. Um, Louis Vane, is that it? Yeah, here we go. If you don't know about this, he started drawing off like cats and uh, he had some sort of mental thing. He started off, this is like at the start of it, and eventually the cat started looking like this. <laughs> this music is not helping. I'm meant to sit around and just watch this. It was actually the drug stroll. Oh yeah, LSD was it? Okay, thanks. Wake up. Okay, everything is good. All right, let's go save. All right. We can spin around in the chair, look at that. Okay. Get me out. Oh, why is it so laggy when you do that? <laughs> oh, oh, Steam version is just laggy. It's a bug, yeah. okay. 100% CPU usage. Okay. Hmm. I know I can use the console, but... Uh... Okay, I guess we're gonna... Sleep. Do it while dreaming. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> Multiple times. Okay, yeah. Hmm. 
Is that an eyeball? What is that? Hmm. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Jams. In fact, chat, you're gonna you're gonna join in on this one. You're gonna join in on this one, boys. Get your best favorite dance emotes out now, boys. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, why the hell not? <laughs> I like the deleted comments too, you know. <laughs> it's like there's so many comments, he's like bah! breaks it. Too, you know? <laughs> All right, that's fun. Actually, look, hey, 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 unintentional. Look at that. I love it. Too. I love it. Too. Okay. Okay. Someone said, go to bed while in the dream? Do I go in, out, in, out, in, out like that? Okay. Three, two, one. Activate. Okay. There are seven beds. It chooses one per dream. Uh, okay. Uh, Something like this doesn't work here. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, where are we going next? We've been there. We're we're, we're all haven't been to yet. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let's go to the. Uh, let's go to the sewers. Let's go to the sewers and stab that guy. I can't believe I'm saying that. Hey, let's go stab! Oh, wait, what's this? Igloo. I'm guessing this is an area where you need the scarf. Hello. Snow woman. Okay. Morph into snow woman. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Yeah. Let's see. I have one. Is kitchen knife part of the effects or whatever? Yeah. Yes. Okay, so wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten effects. Okay. Okay, check this out. Oh. Huh. What is this? It looks like magic and a lot. <laughs> okay. I like the music here. I like the loop. If we go up here. Can't quite do that yet. Find a balloon, says chap. Okay. Okay. A magic balloon. Hmm. So if I 
head down here and I head here. I'm noticing that the maps in Yumaniki, they are really, really large. I mean, due to the fact that they also loop in, in certain ways, that they feel more extensive, but yeah. Okay, here we go. Here's, here's the magic balloon. Okay, so if I get this... Uh, let's go north. Uh, can I... <laughs> can I use the bike in the, in the water? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Okay. Uh, super legs. Okay. We got found a green one. Okay. This looks so much like magic. Can I? I man. <laughs> Wait a minute. This. This. Is this it? This is it, isn't it? Wait a minute. Can't talk and do nothing yet, but I can do this! Three, two, one. Oh, you have to leave. Oh. First try. Boom! Okay. Three, two, one. Watch this. Damn it. Third time's the charm, boys. Three, two, one. Damn it. All right. Here we go. This is it. Not kidding. Really, check this out. <clears throat> Watch this. Watch this. If I get the thing here right now, Um, I'll stream Neopets. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> okay. How about this? I'll stream Neopets for three hours. <laughs> What's chat doing? Oh my god. Summon a boa, summon a boa. You know what? You know what? You know what? You guys keep it up. You guys keep. I'm gonna put this on screen. I'm gonna put this on screen right now. We need him. We need him. We need him. That's right. Keep keep it up, chat. <laughs> Just like this. <laughs> keep going. Keep going. Yes! Yes! Keep it up! Keep it up! Oh, fuck it. You can do it, chat! You can do it! It's gonna happen right now. We need more spam! We need more spam! Maximize the tap dancing friends! More! More! Oh, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I'm still doing this, but I am. I'm going to Leary's doing this. Who's been f fucking with the lights? He's gonna appear five more tries. Check it out. Five. 
four. Three. Two. One. Here he is, the legend. <laughs> Sorry, I bossed it. I meant, uh, here's a boa. Who's that? That guy? Yeah, I know him. First try, by the way. Ah! God. Oh my god. Oh my lord. Uh all right. Well. <laughs> well, it certainly is something. I'll tell you that. Wow, that is that is intense. That is intense. Thanks, chat. You help you help out with that one. So here he is. Here's a boa. And it's it's the most well-known thing from this game, I would say. Um, what is it exactly? I don't know. No. Uh, do, do I talk to him or? Well, uh, I don't think I've ever seen this sprite. Is that him still? All right, we got we got a dude in the back vomiting blood. <laughs> it's, it's pretty nuts. Um, all right, well. Uh, Can I ride the bike in here? Yeah. <laughs> yes, I can. All right. <laughs> Was Gastro inspired by Uboa? Uh, I can see where you're coming from, but I don't, I don't think so. I mean, there's a sort of way of, of, you know, this, this, this Oboa creature or whatever it is, it's hard to obtain. Like, it's it's cryptic enough, and I, I guess in a way, Gastris do. And there's a bit of a gash in the in the eye, I saw that too, but I don't know, you know. Uh, definitely inspired, perhaps, but not, like, tribute. I, maybe, I don't know, maybe, sort of. I don't, I don't say, maybe. <laughs> I went from no to yes. <laughs> you know, uh, do I need to get the, uh, the, uh, eye pump to get out of here? Huh? They, they look literally the same now. Okay. It's kind of creepy that you're stuck in here, you know? Huh? Okay. Uh, well, off we go. Huh? Okay, uh, so what's left? Uh, I'm guessing there's still a ton and ton and stuff left to do in this. Uh, but I, I was, I've finally done it. I've actually seen it in person. You know, that's pretty cool. Huh? It's pretty damn cool. Huh? So there's 24 effects in total. But I think I'll tell you what, uh, for a 70 spooky games, uh, you know, I, I wanted to give this a little bit of a preview. I've streamed it for about three hours and, you know, I got a little bit of a taste on what this was, but uh, that uh, th this game was incredible. Uh, I, I want to see more of it, of course, but I think I, we should save a little extra stuff for a spooky Saturday. So uh, 
you know this is a really cool interesting game i can definitely see why this game is so unique and you know its legacy that it left behind if just the the ripples in the in the you know gaming scene that it left of you know anyone can make a game you know it can make an rpg game it can make it super memorable and people enjoying it but um yeah this is human nikki and uh, i finally got to play it uh, and i'm going to be playing more of this at some point but uh, yeah really really interesting i think this game was um artsy and i think it was interesting you know a lot of games fail to deliver any sort of anything if it's just going to be weird you know but this game gets away with it because it is dreams and just nothing makes sense but that's fine and i i like it you know but uh all right i let's let's go save the game and so we can continue it at a spooky saturday at some point but uh very cool Move while seated oh oh <laughs> all right <laughs> i did not know about this all right we let's go outside can you yes you can yes you can wait a minute can i you can clear the game on this state can i if you equip the bike while in chair you can run really fast how, how would i equip the bike here Can I? You can. You can. You can. How? It's a super fast chair. Yeah, yeah, but how do I like stack this state in the chair with the bike? Can, is that a way to do that? You did it before? No, 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 that's not what I mean. That's not what I mean. I mean, this state of looking like bike speed of the chair glitch in this. Somebody chat says, I'm sitting because I can't stand you guys. You can't. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Well, I guess we're going to be waking up and saving normally. Yeah. All right. Well, once again, that's you, Maniki. Uh, there's more to this game, of course. But uh, will I find every 100% thing? Nah, probably not. But I'll tell you what. Continuation on a spooky Saturday at some point. We have a save gamed and uh, sa saved gamed. <laughs> save game. And, you know, I got to see a little bit of this game and I got to see a boa. And for a little playthrough sample of this game, I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. Um, again, I think as someone stated before, it's more of a journey in this game and it might not be the most streamable game per se but uh i really enjoyed streaming it anyway to experience something firsthand like this game for example so you know but anyway uh that's yumaniki uh we have one more game uh for well this spooky halloween event that we do and that's going to be tomorrow might actually squeeze in too and on top of that a giant halloween stream tomorrow there's a lot to look forward to but anyway uh once again everybody once again uh thank you so much for enjoying yumaniki with me uh we will pick this up and probably finish it before the year is over because i want to at least see an ending so that's that to look forward to but ladies and gentlemen, uh, we're going to be actually doing some of the arts tonight. And after the arts, we have a vineyard coming up. So sit tight, coming up. Uh, stuff. Stuff of uh, great arts. So be right back. Yeah. <laughs> 